um hi guys welcome back to my channel today is a saturday i woke up and wow so i'm a para broke into my car so this morning we woke up to the knock of um, one of our neighbors who noticed that there was a, my wallet on the floor outside my car and that they had broken the window the passenger the passenger whatever window and when we got there i just saw my stethoscope and i saw my wallet on the floor outside the car so basically whoever it is they broke into my car and they took because i like i was tired last night so i didn't even take my bags out of my car so there was my hand two handbags one i carry for work and my like the normal one which had my id and then the the bag that i think i showed you guys that my mom got for me it had hospital scrubs in it and it had my name outside so basically they took that bag and they took both my handbags and that you know my work bag with um hospital scrubs basically the green scrubs from the hospital and i think they dropped the wallet while running the guy there's even like blood outside the the, the thingy outside the window to show that one of the guys hurt himself while trying to you know smash my window and the whole thing was just so upsetting like i was just like what does this world turn into like so 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 annoying but luckily um i'm just glad that they dropped the wallet hey like the only thing that's like most valuable that i lost is it was my id document and it's that green book and i hadn't gone to get that new id the cards so um th that's literally the only thing that i lost other than the fact that i lost two sentimental bags one i got from my sister one i got from my mom and yeah and the weird thing is that you know with the south african justice system here it's so 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 whack so whack to the point where um we saw that they'd broken into my car at around eight it's 10 o'clock no it's half past 10 it's half past 10 they've been coming since half past 10 and i just asked myself what if it was like actually like something serious what if i was like there's people outside they're running blah 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 or i just got raped or like do they actually respond to such lo and behold they haven't come they have not yet come hopefully like, like if i find out these things are expensive i'm claiming hey like i'm taking it via like insurance but if it's like stuff that's like cheap if it's things that are like cheap and affordable like if everything is less than 500 or like six at most then i can do it <sighs> so the stuff it's like my like it's clear like my para basically we go to work and people just come and steal your stuff like what the fuck <laughs> loki i hope he gets the silent lighters i'll be watching and waiting <laughs> Sure. I can I can't believe Because they decided to steal my bag, I had to use one of the hospitals. <laughs> one of the hospitals, like bags or whatever that they used for sterile packs. To put my scrubs in because wow, couldn't see my guy mess. guys it's your mess so anyways this is my courtesy car <laughs> this is my courtesy car i think this car looks better on tv hey because wow <laughs> i mess like my husband calls it a mini suv <laughs> i'm b i'm b it's even worse inside like like it looks so bad 
It's manga se monto. It's so high. <laughs> Basically because I had lost my ID or my bag got stolen in the IT Pakati, I had to I'm basically faced with the responsibility of having to make a new ID. And right now it's around past four, ten past four. And been to home affairs, I was already inside and you guys know how long it takes just to get inside a home affairs. Luckily for me, this time around, um what had happened was that um Kutega Bees were like basically I was in the line, I was probably the like twentieth person. Then the guy who was calling the people just, you know, said everyone who's here to make an ID come to the front. It was a mess. Um there was a whole stampede. But basically luckily for me I made it as part of the ten people who got in luckily because basically I also didn't deserve to be in because the figure say late like I literally got there like fifteen, twenty minutes before I got in. Long story short, I make it inside. Um, Sifago system means Sifago Magaba sort of. Now we're just waiting to have our fingerprints taken as well as our photos taken. And um, <laughs> they do the first four people and the system was offline. The camera wasn't cameraing. <laughs> camera stopped working. It could not take any more like pictures and stuff like that. So um, they tried to reboot the whole watch my call. It don't work. So, yeah, I don't know. I'm giving up for now. Like, guys, I can't cute at all. Um, I don't know what happened to my lips. In the abscess, I put color mine on. I know it looks disgusting. But the situation is a bit tight. So I'm just trying. Like, I don't know. I just got a small pimple. It looked like a love pimple. Next thing, my whole lip was swollen. Next thing, I think it's an abscess. I don't know. Anyways, I'm getting ready to go. I'm packing. Um, I think I have to leave in the next two and a half hours. <laughs> this looks so bad. <laughs> this looks so bad. Anyways, yeah. I have to leave in the next... <laughs> no, I can't take myself seriously. Anyways. So, yeah. It doesn't get as real as this, Okay. Yeah, let me go take a bath or shower or whatever. I'm just trying to work this. Like, I want your bed to, like, it's not like a cold blister. It's like a bad love pimple. Like, what you... And it's not as big. It's just, I don't know what happened to the color mine. It just went all over the place. Hey. just arrived at my airbnb in cape town it was located in woodstock and it was beautiful creepy looking Four minutes. 11 okay so let me give you guys a bit of a room tour um so this is the just entered through the door they're doing this whole black whatever theme. Um, the bathroom is cute or whatever. Uh, the shower is humongous. The shower is huge. And then we come to this side. So it's like a studio apartment. It's like a nice painting with lights in the overhead area. I guess it's a place where you can put on the pillows. Um, hangers, iron, iron board, the usual. 
I like this whole sliding whatever material. Okay, this is a vacuum cleaner if you're feeling up to it. <laughs> of which I'm not. Um, and there's like a glass divider thingy separating. And a small table with a nice cute fridge. Yeah, guys, it's beautiful. This place is beautiful. I already switched the heater on because you already know what time it is. And that's the view. It's beautiful. There's like nice places underneath, guys. I'll show you guys later. Hello. about me i love 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 spending time with myself or just being on my own so i just went across to this nice coffee shop which is very hippie the whole area is actually very hippie and there's actually a bunch of bakeries and sorbet places just across the airbnb so this is the building and <laughs> I'm gonna try finish off the movie that I already started watching, which was oh, Intruder. I've been watching that movie for the past two days. I still haven't finished watching it. Like every time, there's like some distraction and something else to do. So basically, I'm just gonna try do that. And okay, let me just first wash off the makeup off my face, and then. Um, after washing the makeup or the makeup off my face, uh, I try to watch the movie. Oh, I'm so tired. Also, I try to drink a lot of water. It's around 11 p.m. I think. Yeah. So my sister just left because she has to go to work. Apparently, it's gone as Gavali, and also they keep on having such meetings. So yeah, she's still busy with that. Um, but my friends are like arriving tomorrow. So yeah, um, <laughs> more fun. More fun is yet to be had. More fun is yet to be had. By the time I'm out the shower, things things are much much better. I just need the strength to like. I just need strength to like get to the shower. <laughs> I just need strength to like shower. Let me just say a silent prayer. And then the next time you see me, I will be in my most natural, most natural form. Okay. <laughs> 